Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Welcome back to another episode of City Skylines Sunset Harbor DLC in the great city of Portsmouth Abbey. As you can tell uh, from the first cinematic view that our city is really growing at a really good pace and everything seems to be going really well. We're making tons of money. As I zoom out, we have tons of stuff going on here around the city. If you guys do remember, um, one of our last builds was this Endor National Park, and it looks fantastic. A lot of people had some good comments about it. So for today, I wanted to do something that was a little different. I wanted to do how to build the helicopter transportation system. So for today, um, you're going to need the City Skyline Sunset Harbor DLC for this build. So if you don't have that, well, you will not be able to add helicopters to your city. So what we're going to do is I know I already put in a helicopter depot over here, but for this time, I'm actually going to re put it in just for the purpose of actually building the helicopter transportation system in our city. So I'm going to click that helicopter depot. What the helicopter depot does, it is very similar to the bus depot and the tram depot in order to have the helicopters or trams or buses replicate you need a depot so we this is our helicopter depot and that is where all of our helicopters are going to render from so step two is actually building helicopter stops so we have these helicopter stops they're 320 dollars a week and they initially cost twenty thousand per so what i want to do is I, I need to build a couple stops so i do want one kind of near the airport over here even though this is kind of similar to where remember the depot is not a helicopter stop so let's put one here i am going to be a little aggressive and just put one across the the river or the bay it's not even a river across the just across i don't know i don't know the word i'm looking for but let me know in the comment section below what we're, what the word i'm looking for is and i'm actually going to place one right next to our beach area which i think would be really cool to have um eventually this area to the right is gonna grow in so i'm not really too concerned about it being in an empty spot right now so really don't worry about that then let's get closer to our city um oh this would be a really good spot right here this is kind of in our downtown area and it's near a tram uh, tram a train station and that will work really really well now, I do want to kind of create a very custom one, um, not custom, but a very, this is going to be kind of aggressive. I'm going to say, I would like to build one right there. Okay, let's see how well it's going to fit. And it does fit. It does work. Let's just see the tree line. I mean, oh my God. So that building we had before actually fit perfectly with the helicopter pad wow okay and you know what when a helicopter is landing they do it pretty vertically so i'm actually 100 percent okay with that so this is in the middle of our nature preserve i know that's a little aggressive but you know what i kind of want to see how well it helps our nature preserve grow i think that's pretty cool honestly so now that we have a couple different different um helicopter pads let's start building the paths so let's go back to our, first of all, we need to start at the depot, which is right over here. Grab that helicopter path and kind of bring it out to about over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect the helicopter depot to our paths. Can we go this way? Yep, there we go. Okay, so we have our helicopter depot connected to this helicopter pad now we should be able to cr now once we have helicopter lines which are like our bus line and trial lines the helicopters will replicate or render whatever word you want to use so let's connect up over here first so this is going to be our oh this is going to be a cool line that this line is going to be for um connecting our beachfront to our airport and then we're going to grab our airport line to this is going to be our vip flight line to our marina slash resort which actually that is what it's called well it's marina and resort but you know close enough 
So we're going to have one to our downtown area, a nice little line there. And then we're going to go, this is going to be our aggressive one. We're going to have, well, this is, this is kind of exciting and kind of scary at the same time. So that is one of our long helicopter paths. We're going to, like I said, we're going to, we're going to see if it works. I'm not entirely sure if it's a great idea, but you know. So let's keep going. So where should this path go? Okay, so this is our long. Let's have it go here. So basically we have two ways of getting to and from our nature, our national nature reserve. And it should, we can go from this, this helicopter pad or this helicopter pad. So it shouldn't be too bad. Now let's create the helicopter lines. So we're gonna grab, start here. This one's going to be very quick. So go here to our to our beachfront and then we're just going to have it swing right back. Nothing honestly, nothing insane. That's not very complicated. Then we can start create a new one here. Go here and that's going to be our very short one, but very short flight, but you know, it's our VIPs. They are special people. So we're going to start a line here and we're going to bring it right over here. And then I think we're actually going to go all the way to our nature reserve from here. I don't think that's a bad idea, honestly. And then just have it come back. We're come back here and then have it come back to where it all began. There you go. So that is kind of a, a cool little way of building the helicopter line. So let's 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 start a helicopter line all the way out here so that so that they have their own de dedicated line. So we're gonna create a path, go all the way down. Wow, this is this is gonna be a cool flight though. If you think about it, this flight is literally gonna go throughout our entire city. So that's pretty neat, honestly. And then we'll have that go there and then we'll add stop going back. So basically we have two different ways of getting to our nature preserve. and. It, you know, if this doesn't work, uh, you guys can harass me. But um, in the comment section below, please remember to like, subscribe, and comment. I would greatly appreciate that. And I, I'm still okay with the trees and stuff like that. Uh, let's see how many people are actually using this cable line. Garbage piled up, but 88 people. Okay. Sorry. Let's go back to our helicopter. So now that we have all the lines in place, let's zoom out. Now the the... Helicopter Depot is rendering is rendering all the helicopters and they're going to go on its flight path and you know it's going to work out pretty well. Now the, the only negative I would say really about the helicopters is that there's only 20 passengers to each helicopter. So that's something to be aware of. It's not as much obviously a train has way more passengers, a tram has way more passengers. These helicopter lines should be taking people from, you know, like I kind of actually do like the nature preserve idea of going from one side of the city to the next, but this is just an easier way of getting people to and from the city in a smaller area. Wow. We have it. And we have a whole army of helicopters right now. Uh, obviously as time goes on, they will separate from each other. So please don't freak out and be like, wow, sports monkey. What did you do? And it's honestly just because they need to spread out and that will happen eventually. Um, but so this is basically, you know, this is what happens when you have the helicopter depot and people really do like using the helicopters. Look at, we already have a line like director at the incineration plant. Wow. What a job, but look at how like, we already have a line and people coming here to fly out of our city. Now, the real question is, is what about the nature preserve? Do you think people are lining up to go home? Like, could you imagine like, all right, I'm just going to take the helicopter to the nature reserve and then go home. No big deal. Let's see if we have a line. We do have a line. Oh my God. That actually worked out really well. Oh my God. All right, guys. See, look at you guys have to give me some credit for putting it there. The helicopter line there. So thank you guys for watching. I truly do appreciate it, but we had a fantastic episode. Now, I do know that this little loop needs police and garbage. I get that. But I think we successfully, 
I think we did a good job with the helicopter line. So if you guys want to know more about helicopters, please let me, please leave me a comment or like or something along those lines. And, you know, I'll get to it. I will respond to it. Uh, I'm usually pretty good about it. Or there's actually a lot of other, there's actually a lot of other people that are fantastic resources in the comment section. So, uh, you know, just comment and we have a pretty good family of people that usually, you know, myself will comment or a few other people will comment, which is not really a big deal. So I'm very excited about this train line, train line, helicopter line. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day.